Good afternoon, everybody. Welcome to our KRQE.com webcast. I'm Deanna Sauceta. We begin with meteorologist John Smith in the first forecast. Hi, John. Hi, Deanna. We will be looking for showers across a good portion of the state throughout much of the week. It will be different areas at different times. We'll break it down with Super Storm Track, where we'll see some showers and storms over the northern mountains, over toward the Four Corners, and over into western sections as well throughout the afternoon. That will continue into the evening. Could get a couple of spot showers, make their way into the metro and other central sections of the state. Then tomorrow, we'll continue to push that moisture into the central and eastern parts of the state. So we'll start to see better chances of showers toward the east. And as we move in toward Wednesday, we'll continue with that chance across the central and eastern parts of the state. Eventually, all this moisture starts to push back toward the west by the time we reach the end of the week and we start to dry out for the weekend. We could find out today if the man who died in a police shootout in Dulce yesterday is the same man who police say shot at them last week and took off into the mountains. State police say just before 8 yesterday morning, a man who looks like Rex Sherwood broke into the 64 Express gas station. When police got there, they say the man started shooting at them and police shot back. When it was all done, the man was dead. Now police are trying to find out if the man who died was indeed Sherwood and if they killed him or if he shot and killed himself. Police have been looking for Sherwood since last Tuesday. A serious accident in northeast Albuquerque this morning. It took emergency crews nearly half an hour to get people out of the vehicles involved in the accident at Wantabo and Lomas. A courtesy van run by Gallus Chevrolet was T-boned by some sort of government truck. Six passengers were transported. Three of them are in critical condition, according to Albuquerque police. We'll stay with KRQE for more news and weather updates throughout the day. Have a good Monday. We'll see you tomorrow.